speed helped me a lot lot of model test those mock tests and all lot of question and rest i guess in dm gastro this thing we have this lesinger and potter answer that is the standard textbook questions from there i guess like tables and like important images those things i revised and i read those things sir so i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute to dr sailesh kayalia for scoring a topmost rank of cml rank number 6 and uh, in dm medical gastroenterology in ss october 2021 session congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir thank you thank you once again yeah great to have you here today can we know your background details from where you started till date what i have done uh, sir i did my undergrad from wims bangalore did my md from uh, pj rotak and uh, now like i completed my md last year sir around july july 23 and uh, this was my second iniss which i gave okay first one was in may and this is my second iniss that i gave sir great doctor can we know why a special interest for bm gastroenterology thing was clear sir like uh, when i joined md i wanted some intervention branch okay so i had only two options uh, after md that was like med, uh, cardio and the other one was gastro cardio was like quite intense and it's an like emergency based branch and gastro is like on a lighter note so that's why gastro very good very good excellent now once you decided to do that uh, what did you do how did you start the preparation what was your strategy and what is the key behind your success uh, sir i started my prep in march march this year sir initially like after my md i uh, joined sr ship i was not clear like whether i have to i was not clear like i will be doing dm or should i continue should i be like should this md suffice so initially i did sr ship then later on around december i realized that no i should be doing dm so that was the time like around feb or march i started preparations of serious preparations for dm gastro uh i gave may iniss uh in that i did not qualify <laughs> so after that i was clear like uh, i need to change my strategies so this time around i did like a uh, lot of questions and that's where speed helped me a lot like uh, i did a lot of model test those mock tests and all so i guess a lot of question and rest i guess in dm gastro this thing uh, we have this lesinger and potter answer that is the standard textbook so questions from there i guess like um, tables and like important images those things i revised and i read those things sir great now you could how many questions did you attempt doctor uh, sir i attempted around 77 questions out of which i got around 62 questions correct i guess very good so what will be your advice to the future aspirants of dm gastro so joining an institute is very important sir i feel uh, and that i'm not saying that uh, you will get the direct questions from there but suppose you solve some questions by that you'll get to know the important topics and those important topics you can stress on and those important topics have been already like made concise by the uh, esteemed faculties which are present here and you can solve a lot of questions although those questions won't get repeated but that will help you rule out so i guess uh, important thing is doing a lot of questions and uh, sticking to some standard textbook time to thank whom all you want to thank that they helped you to build your career till date uh, sir i would like to thank my wife <laughs> she has been my constant support uh, while i was preparing uh, my parents my siblings all my esteemed faculties uh, who helped me in this thing and my friends especially like uh, even one of my friend who cleared dm humat even he has been a constant support for me okay great doctor so nice talking to you and uh, on your success and we are really happy that uh, you have made it and we once again wish you all the very best and all the success for a great career in dm gastroenterology thank you so much sir thank, thank you thank you once again thank you